Well, the provincial by-election for Hamilton Centre hasn't been called yet, but the race is already heating up. The leader of the NDP is in town to shore up support in a riding that's been orange, while the three other major parties try to change that. Matt Ingram reports. Visiting the campaign office on King Street, provincial NDP leader Marit Stiles is here to support Sarah Jama in a much anticipated but not yet called by-election to fill Andrea Horvath's old seat. Uh, we've been ready for a while. Sarah is more than ready uh, to take on this race and to represent this community. Jama is a co-founder of the Disability Justice Network of Ontario and a well-known Hamilton activist who says she wants to help renters tackle affordability issues and increase voter engagement. My priority is making sure that I'm working with Marit and caucus to fight for it. And that means tackling voter disengagement and making sure people understand that we are here to fight. She says she's not taking anything for granted, but likes her chances. Oh, I'm going to win. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not worried about it. Three other candidates are running against JAMA to try and flip this longtime NDP stronghold. Hamilton Centre has been held by the party since 2007 when Andrea Horvath first won the seat. Party politics is cyclical and this is an upswing for the Liberal uh, Party in Ontario. Equity advocate, social planner and columnist Deirdre Pike is running for the Liberals, highlighting the urban boundary, affordability and the education system as top priorities, as well as a desire to create what she calls a Hamilton caucus to work across party lines with all local MPPs. What can we do together that will improve lives for Hamiltonians here? Be good, brother. Good to see you, man. Speaking with supporters on Barton Street East today, the PC party is betting veteran Hamilton police officer Pete Wisner can turn the riding blue. A Tory last won here in 1963. Priorities are, is going to be infrastructure, jobs and health care. He says his knowledge of the neighbourhood and experience as the leader of the services crisis response branch has prepared him to serve as MPP. My passion goes beyond just law enforcement. My passion has been uh, everything from uh, mental health, addiction, homelessness, right up to just serving the people of this great city. Hamilton Centre exemplifies a lot of the challenges that Ontario as province is facing. Engineer Lucia Yanantuono is running for the Greens, saying she's focused on bringing transformative changes on tough issues like health care, homelessness and the climate crisis. Hamilton and all of Ontario cannot expand any further. We need to freeze urban boundaries. Locking ourselves into an unsustainable future prevents things like having better transit, having park space, having affordable housing. The by-election must be called no more than six months after Horvath vacated her seat, which means it must be called soon. Matt Ingram, CHCH News, Hamilton.